people, people dis, a lot of rich people especially, don't necessarily like the X1 uh, because they feel like it's below them, okay? And they don't like them. But it actually, this car is actually a pretty nice, legit vehicle, okay? It drives well. It's nice and fast for a four-cylinder, four-wheel drive, solid build. All right, let's test this beast out. Man, this thing's got some kick. It's got a little bit of power, gotta admit. As you can see at night, it's pretty nice. Uh, that lights up. You see the little white light that lights up? It looks pretty cool when you turn all the lights off. Watch this. Boom. You see that? And you got your gauges and switches and stuff. And you know how Lexus, you just, you get in a Lexus and it just, the seats are, you melt in them, literally, they're so comfortable. When you look at these German cars, they're solid, the seating, okay? They're not bad, but you're not really comfortable in them. They're not soft, you don't just, they're not like little pillows like the Lexuses are. And as you can see, your little key fob, you got your lock on lock trunk and panic pretty basic there's no key on this one not that i know of so this is keyless one backup cameras this is a basic model so there's nothing else just a basic no sensors no sensors on on the mirrors automatic all right here we go Nice little LED lights. It's kind of hard to see them right now. On both sides. Beautiful. Lock. So from, from the back it looks okay. It's got the dual exhaust. Pretty nice. And it doesn't sound like a four cylinder normal four-cylinder bmw you're not hearing all kinds of noises when you're with this engine with this vehicle so this is an x1 2018 x drive we're gonna really look at this car nice all right you got the lights we're gonna turn them on we're gonna look in and out this first off this is a basic model right you can get this for around you know 35 uh, you got possibly leather but I don't think these are leather they're pleather um what I can say about this car is that if you're if you're maybe over six feet tall and weigh you know over 200 pounds you know this car isn't really designed for you but you can fit in here you can literally fit in this car basic cruise control here you you got your radio operation telephone um this is the drive you can switch it on sport mode if you want you want an economy comfort all right so i usually keep it on sport this is a pretty fast car i mean it's not slow it's reliable it's solid but it's not real roomy okay but it's not real tight it's not it's kind it's okay it's okay if you got two or three kids you're okay with this car okay so you, your basic of your connect drive here i don't think i see the uh, the gps in here whoops that kind of sucks but you know you don't really need it i usually set my cell phone here so you got your bluetooth and stuff it's not a bad little car but pretty basic, okay? Um, 
not roomy, but like I said, not too bad. Okay, you're not you're not going to be tight in here unless you're real big. The seats are kind of small. Um, yeah, you got your little remote right here. Basic. Unlock. Lock. Look at the back. Not too bad. And also the trunk area is pretty roomy. I pop the trunk open. Auto open. Not bad. You can fit, you fit your groceries in here. So overall okay. Push button close. So the engine's okay, nice and quiet. I, oh, my personal opinion, not a bad little vehicle. You want to get it, get it. It's worth the money. I mean, you're getting it for for you know under forty thousand. This is a amazing car for that price. Um, and and they're pretty reliable. X ones are reliable. They got power. You know, if you're on a highway, you need to pass somebody. You know, easy. You love this car. Anyway, a nice little car. Peace out.